the Gooch Close Gang, also known as the GCOGs, Gooch Close Original Gangsters, or simply the Gooch in Manchester, is an organised crime group based in Mossad and surrounding neighbourhoods of South Manchester, England. Most members of the gang grew up on the west side of the Alexandra Park estate in Mossad around Gooch Close, which is where the gang gets its name. The Gooch is part of an alliance of Crips gangs and has had a violent disputes with many South Manchester gangs, most notably the Doddington Gang, formerly known as the Pepper Hill Mob, the Mossad Bloods and the Longsight Crew. The Gooch Gang has its origins in the west side of the Alexandra Park Estate in Mossad. Young men would hang around the Shabin on the Gooch Close selling drugs, which is where the gang started and how they got their name. Gooch Close was a small cul-de-sac of semi-detached houses with an alley at one end. In the mid-1990s, the Alexandra Park Estate was redeveloped and the street was redesigned and its name changed to Westerlin Way. The gangs, while supplying to street dealers, also tried to ensure that the dealers were protected from other gangs by protecting their territory. Most of their problems occurred when rival street dealers started to move into the territory already controlled by a gang or when a gang taxed a rival dealer, a move seen as damaging street credibility and respect. The gangs in South Manchester, including the Gooch Gang, were made up of mostly first and second generation British West Indies Caribbean heritage members whose grandparents came to England from the 1950s as part of the Windrush generation. Around the same time, the Gooch Close Gang was becoming known around the city. The Pepper Hill Gang were also starting to emerge, taking their name from the pub on the east side of the Alexandra Park Estate. When the pub was closed down, the gang targeted by police, they reformed around nearby Doddington Close and would go on to become known as the Doddington Gang. In the late 1980s and early 90s, the Pepper Hill Gang were involved in a war between Moss Side and the Cheatham Hill Gang from North Manchester. The Gooch often bought and sold drugs with the Cheatham Hill Gang. The Gooch had close ties to Cheatham Hill, with the cousin of the Cheatham Hill head being a leading figure in the Gooch. The Pepper Hill Gang thought this was helping the enemy. The Pepper Hill Gang declared that nobody from South Manchester was to have dealings with Cheatham Hill. This angered the Gooch and a fierce war erupted, dividing the Alexandra Park Estate in half with the Gooch on the west side and the Pepper Hill on the east side. Although the gang war was centred around Moss Side, young males from neighbouring areas would be drawn into the conflict resulting in a number of deaths and regular shooting incidents in South Manchester throughout the 1990s and 2000s. In 1996, an offshoot gang was identified, Young Gooch, which gained a frightening reputation for violence and guns its members used. Five of its members were later arrested following Operation Eagle and were sentenced to more than 43 years in prison. The young Gooch started to war with a newly emerging Longsight crew, a younger offshoot of the Doddington gang whose members were based on a number of estates in the Longsight and Ardwick areas of South Manchester, especially their headquarters of Langport Avenue. By the mid-2000s, the Gooch gang had grown to become a vast gang made up of a number of smaller offshoot crews based around South Manchester, the most notable of these being the Longside Street Soldiers, Old Trafford Crips, Rush Home Crips and Fallowfield Mad Dogs. These gangs would carry on the rivalry with the Doddington and Longside crew into the 2000s. Ten members of South Manchester's Gooch Gang 
were put on trial in October 2008 for a catalogue of gang-related crimes. Gang members Colin Joyce and Lee Amos had been arrested in 2000 when they had been apprehended at their nerve centre in a house in Mossside, found with an extraordinary array of firearms. In 2001, they had been sentenced to nine years in prison, but had been released early on licence in 2007, and they had followed a new bout of shootings. In April 2009, Joyce and Amos were among 11 members of the Gooch Gang who were found guilty and charged with a catalogue of crimes which included the murder of Hugh Calchin and Tyrone Gilbert. These convictions were hailed by Manchester's Chief Prosecutor John Holt as having enormous significance for public safety. Their trials were held 35 miles away at Liverpool Crown Court to lower the risk of witness intimidation from other gang members. Not usually the perpetrators of gun crime were also the victims, with Amos's brother Stephen Babe Tunde Amos having been shot dead in a gang-related shooting aged 21 outside a bar in Ashton under line in 2002. Colin Joyce, aged 29, known as the leader of the gang, was given a minimum 39-year sentence. Lee Amos was sentenced to receive at least 35 years. Three other members of the gang were given minimum sentences of between 30 and 35 years. Please like this video, please comment and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.